Welcome back to NG. It's time to finish up the screaming author. Or put her out of her misery. Now, was it a man or was it a woman? Well, you heard the ghost. Does that sound like a man to you? Well, unless he's like part pelican. Well, right now we're part buffet because we're getting eaten! Alright. Time to exercise this ghost. It's time for a tale! The man found a poor little birdie. The man wanted to save the little birdie. The man chopped off the little birdie's arms and legs. Gross. Mm. Well, probably a bit of column A and column B, me bucko. <laughs> Well, like column N and column G. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey. Yeah. <laughs> that joke was N G. Not mm. funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh God. I really hope I never have to exercise your spirit. Are you kidding? I'd kill you by the first round. Well, fuck you. Bring it. <laughs> if if either of us die before the other, let's try to exercise one another. It'd be the final challenge. Ah, but then top shelf bourbon. A man of good taste. But then again, you'd have to, like, royally piss me off before I die, and then I'd haunt you. I don't think that's ever gonna happen, though. I have hey, to do you something bad to piss you off. Well, it would have to be something pretty amazing because I don't get mad often. Hey, oh, uh, sorry, I spilled some ketchup on your shoe. What? Hey, do you remember when we nearly fi uh, finished off a uh, leader of Woodford Reserve in one night? Yeah. Threw on some Knob Creek on that as well. That was, uh... That was about the hardest drinking I've done in a long time and since. And, of course, uh, the fireball added to that didn't help. But, you know, it was ushering in the year 2019. <laughs> My fucking god. I was not good the next morning. <laughs> I think I'm more of a rum guy now. I'm down for whatever, just as long as it tastes fruity. So, Tsubasa Aoi. Mm. And the, that does not say Tubasa. <laughs> so, okay, okay, okay. So, this is a certain type of romanization. I don't know what the exact word is, but uh, we call it JSL romanization. And by we, I mean the people who uh, had to use Japanese, the spoken language, which is a book that is only available at Yale, Cornell University, and The Ohio State University, because that is where one of the co-writers teaches. It uses a different kind of romanization. It, instead of using, like, T-S-U for Tsu, they, they use T-U. Instead of C-H-I for Chi, they just use T-I. It's a better way to visualize the, uh, the, uh, the Romanji, I guess. So when it comes to, like, you know, predicates and copulas and stuff like that. So when you see Tubasa, it's really just Tsubasa. That's very interesting. You know, she isn't S-H-I, it's S-I. You know, we were really close to Thanos. We were, weren't we? So, how many girls? Four. Four girls. We got tapes on all four of them. Uh, so because he's got 
relatives oh, who are in, in cushy jobs no. in the government. He just kidnapped girls and no one would ever pay him any mind. So he had connections too. Wow, what a piece of shit. What a piece of shit. But, enough of that though. We got a curse going on. We got some fucked up shit we gotta unfuck up. So, here we go. I think if we had like, you know, a four kids reworking of this game, I think he <laughs> might just be called Jeffrey Epstein. Instead of taking off her limbs, he's taking her stuffed animals. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, my name is Are Josh. You kidding? Are you kidding? Ah! Wow! It's progressing this even is further! Going Man, fast. this is fast! Bring it on! Alright! It's almost the finale of the tale! The birdie becomes a crane and repays the man. Ton karate, ton karate from beyond the door! Yeah, alright. What? Well, Bon, it's an extremely long story. It's just something's eating away at me. You know, I just feel like a gnashing sensation everywhere. Ooh, do you think that's all over our body? Or just our neck and face? All over our body. Ah! You just gave me, like, shivers. I hate it. Like, put your hand somewhere. On your body. Okay. Everybody at home, put, put your hand on your, on your somewhere. body somewhere. Somewhere. I got mine on my shoulder. Where's yours? I got mine on my knee. Well, that's where a mouth is. Ow! Fuck! Mm. And it's just gabbing at you. Imagine having a constant nag of a mouth somewhere on your body. Also, it hurts like sin. So when the when the curse starts, you hear something like that goes like, you know, It's basically the mouth saying, die, 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 <laughs> die, over and over again. Holy shit, that's a terrible curse. My life depends on it. Let's go. So today we're taking Bon with us. Interesting. Okay. Do you think our companions who don't actually get to see the purification of the ghost are really, like, let down that they didn't get to see the action? Maybe Hazuki. So, this is the, the last threshold. Hmm. It's pretty clear what we gotta do. I mean, first one here, uh, I'm just giving it away right now. Uh, first one is the. Dog mask. Yes. So, is there something written on those charms there that tells you which one is which? I, I, I think so. Second one. It doesn't even look like you can examine them. Is the monkey mask. And the third one. Yeah, you can. That's the that's magnifying glass. Is oh, okay. the pheasant mask. Now, is there any significance to this order? Probably. Oh, well. I mean, the mouths really hurt. I really gotta just deal with this. I don't. I don't need a fucking. <laughs> You've got a strategy guide in your back pocket. It's like, okay, Bond, the curse really hurts. We we just need to get through this. Oh my There's god! Our stairs. We made it. Really don't like what's. This just feels bad, man. Okay, here we go. Let's go. <sighs> <laughs> I 
exactly what I figured. Nothing! Behind the sliding door. Well... Oh. But, I kinda have to. That's okay. I mean, I'll give you some chance to- some time to prepare if you want, but... Mm, that's the screaming author? Fuck it, I'm coming in! Really? Okay. Throw caution to the- Ah! Uh... Oh my! Oh my word! Oh, there's some giblets there. That's some chunks over there, man! Oh, time to rummage Let's my hands through it! <laughs> Let's touch it! <laughs> Woo! Fucking hell. Now, I know they can't show what I think they want to show, otherwise they get an AO rating. Ah. What? Whoa! That's a whole bunch of people's blood. Oh, no! Oh, no! Ew! Mm, that's great. How about the box? It's locked. Another part of the reason why we need, uh, bond for this, but there's a sheet of black paper? What in the world is this? Oh, it's carbon paper. Hmm. Well, yes, Bon. I wasn't born yesterday. It's 1999. Everybody kind of knows what that shit is by now. So over here to the bedroom. There's papers in a typewriter. Interesting. All right, author. I see. I see. Most of them are blank sheets. There are a few that have some title. Sati Kanigasen. Saru Kanigasen. Yeah, Kunre Shiki romanization. Oh, hey, this is what you were talking about. <laughs> yes. Sometimes it's called JSL style romanization because that's the only book that uses that romanization. <laughs> Can you imagine being the author that changes an entire romanization? I think even then there's a third type of romanization. Hana? Hi. Okay, so for all of you English speakers out there, try to solve this puzzle, I dare you. There's been a couple of names used already. Yeah, so I recognize I No Onageshi. No Ongashi. Blank no Ongaishi. Hmm. Well, I'm glad you're, uh, taking the helm on this one, so what is it? Okay, well... <sighs> Tell me, Mr. Big Shot. You can, you can solve this by looking at the case file, but first, uh... uh damn it, there's some blood on here. <laughs> Oops! Good morning, Vietnam! Engrave my fairy tale?
Engrave my fairy tale. Uh. So, we just gotta fill in the blank with this typewriter. Right? Oh, okay. So, avoiding the blood keys. Sheet of paper set in. See something typed in already. No one dies. sheet. A, B, S, T, and U are the only keys that work. So the word must only use those letters. Okay. Uh, let's, type, let's type some shit. But there's no ink. So you okay. can't save here, guys. Sorry, you gotta find an ink ribbon somewhere. Damn it. Can we advance the timeline to Resident Evil 4 where I don't need an ink ribbon? We got tapes. We can advance it to Resi 7. Oh, that'll work. Oh, uh, use the carbon paper. There you go. That's actually like a smarto. I'm a smart boy. So, smart boy, use the carbon paper. I still have no idea what the solution is, but I at least know how we can get it to look right. Is that the only reason we brought Bond, by the way? Uh, he also helps with the fight at the end. Hmm, okay. Yes, blank no on Gaishi, A, B, S, T, U. So, I know the answer, let's type it in. So, first is, uh, T, U, B, A, S, Two ba oh, Subasa. Yes. Oh look, it's a ghost writer. <laughs> oh my god. I've failed with many of them in the past, however I managed to save the fourth birdie. But it isn't their role. All the birdies have lost all four limbs. It's truly sad. The fourth birdie wails that it does not want to be seen and it wants to die. Truly a pity. I shall at least give her wings and transform her from a little birdie into a beautiful crane. If she became a crane, I'm sure it would show me utmost gratitude, even if it died. Lovely. He thought they were oh. birds. Is there... Did somebody get in the bed? Hmm. Nope. That's, it's probably nothing, because it's been nothing before. So, let's go take a look at the nothing! Sure. Let's take a look at the nothing. It's a bunch of body parts. Uh, maybe it's not nothing. It is very much something. Poor deputy. Bah! Oh my fucking god! Oh! Ugh. Uh, uh. Ooh. Why are there so many arms? Oh no! Did the spirit do- who did do this? What do you do? Oh god! 
It's a surgical stapler. Ooh. God, that spirit had it out for him. No, he did it himself! Oh. Well, that's worse. We didn't see that anymore. We don't see that anymore. But so that's that... Yakumo Moroku. So that's what happened to him, okay. He thought they were birds, and then just stapled little girl's arms to himself. Well, hey, at least the guy who kept chopping off arms and legs of little girls got what he deserved. He became... His body became that akin to, like, a, a meat patty that you dropped on the floor and it slides under the oven for, like, weeks, months, years. So we haven't found the fourth girl doll, which means that this screaming author must be Subasa. That makes sense. She did say, don't look at me. She's crying like a crane, so... Well... I don't need... Ew. Uh... Oh, it's an old key and a syringe with some liquid and an empty medicine bottle. Handy. So just to make sure I was paying attention, did the spirit... I mean, I know he stapled the arms to himself, but did the spirit eventually kill him? Whoa. Or did he just, like, die? So, well... It would be one thing to just die, but to staple all those arms to him? Why would he do that? I mean, that sounds kind of weird. I mean, maybe he just wanted a round of applause. Oh boy. Oh boy. And here we go. I like that one face behind my head. It's like, oh! It is time. Don't peek in. 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 Please don't look, 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 please don't please don't look, please don't look. Well, that means we gotta go peek and look. Mm-hmm. Basically, Kaku is saying, I bet you won't, and you're like, bitch, I might. Well, up we go. Man, this is gonna be freakish. It's like the alligator nurse from the first one. She, like, the most word she said is, don't look. Please don't look. But, uh-oh. Whoa! Well, I guess we're gonna hang around here for a bit. Oh, no. What got a hold of us? Are you kidding me? Don't you dare be a giant spider. They got Bond, too. Bond, your leg is in my face. I can't see. Uh. Ah! Oh. 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 Oh no! Oh, oh, oh. oh no! Everyone say hello to the screaming author! Why does she have a bird face? Because he tried to turn her into a crane, obviously. Uh, oh god! Alright! Um. Well, have fun surviving. So I can't fully concentrate because, you know, I'm all tied up or fucking 
wires are all oh. like, wrapped around us. So it's time okay. for survival escape. Scene one. Uh. You gotta stop the voice. Uh, uh, just scream louder than her. <laughs> well, Bon, if you're the only one that can move. Alright, so look at these cables up here. These wires. I think it's resonating with the screen. Resonating. Hey, wait a minute! Oh! Stiff hair! So if I just... Okay, get the hair! Why? No time to talk, just get the hair! Oh, the... The implications that he tried to make a bird out of a young girl is terrible. And she actually, like, screams like a bird. I hate it. So you rub the hair on the wire. Huh. Seemed to quell it a little bit. I hear birds flying. No. Okay, so where am I now? Let me see. Let me think here. Hmm. Oh, no! Oh, Bon, why are you so heavy? Uh... uh. So, Roku thinks that he's doing the spirit a great favor by making her into a crane. Jesus, he's fucked up. But if you can't tell, of course you don't want to be a fucking crane. So here's your purify and destroy, uh, option here. I don't know what you would even do. Was it ever mentioned? So look at her legs. You look get at her rid leg of looks like a bird's. Uh, we can either use the hard shoes or we can use the spray paint. What? First act, collection of pieces, by the others, second act, Galacticon. Please enjoy the energy and spirit as they perform, adorned in adorable colors. So let's just shake it up and just... Look at your amazing colors. There, it's, it's like yellow. It's a bright, well, it's beautiful, wonderful color. Well, now it just looks more like a chicken leg. There. See? Huh. And you would have missed that spray paint during the first uh, run through of, of the mansion, I think. So that's missable? I think so. Oh my hey. god! Look at it! Hey! It has a beak and a face! Burn, burn it all. So now there's only really one way to take care of this. The now charcoal? We've already done the purify and destroy thing, so. Because we spray painted her legs, that made her think that, you know, ha 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 ha. It's, it's sure. <laughs> So I'm guessing that... I don't know that... why the hard shoes would have destroyed it. Maybe because it would have made it look like more of a crane or whatever, but... Charcoal. I need, the... I need to reach that fire over there. I need to get the... I need the incense. Really? Oh, well, I guess it is... The... Is that like a long stick of incense? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm gonna step on your face for a second. I'm gonna chop off your arm and throw it over there! <laughs> well, at least we got the incense in the fire now. 
Yeah. God, that's so fucking disgusting. You might even be like, you know, a plume of sage or something. Ah. Oh. Either way, yes, fire. Now we gotta. What? What's gonna burn? Ah. Look at you. Oh. You're disgusting. Why did he put so many nails in there? Yeah, fucker said he knew what he was doing. Not good enough, apparently. This is the one that survived? My god. Okay, Sh show me how it's done. All right, so you just look at her there, at her torso. So just the go lit all incense. The the oh, that's lagging yeah, big time. And there you go. Uh, what? I think I, I think I fucked it. Yeah, oh yeah, I, I pressed B accidentally. I think. Oops. Oops. Yeah, let incense go. Ska! I just don't even know what to say. I mean, look at this. Hey, when you do your custom thumbnails, never show the ghosts. Because <laughs> this is like... Oh, this is amazing. Ow, 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 ow! <laughs> <laughs> oh, God! There you go! Boy! Just, just stay there and catch fire, please! No, 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 no! Uh. This is purification? I think it's because we killed it as a girl and not as a crane? Or maybe, yeah, because she wanted to die? The hard shoes would have made her a crane and would have, you know, just angered her more, but because we sprayed colorful colors on her, they made her feel like a girl again, so now her spirit is purified? That'd be my guess, but we... we did it. Go us. Uh, High five. Uh, yeah. Good one. God. Do you think the artist's images keep them up at night? <laughs> like, uh, at, I, one I point, at what point do you make artwork for a game and then you're just like, what have I done? I don't know. I think Junji Ito seems like a pretty well-rested kind of guy. Surprisingly, I don't know how. Because, you know, good horror is all about creativity. That's why it's it's good artistically speaking, you know? Did you know that horror and comedy are almost one and the same? Uh-huh. Structurally speaking? Mm-hmm. The reveals and the setup are kind of the same. That's why they go so well together. That's why it's so easy to make horror comedies. And comedy horrors. I'm not sure which one this is yet. Hey, Ami. D d don't worry. We've almost got you. Don't you don't you worry. D we're we're, we're going to get you out. It's gonna be. Oh, it's been two weeks. So he seems all right. I mean.
no. Ha! Oh! Oh, 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 no! Dear, oh dear. Have you gotten used to Kakurio? He's living in Sushio. Kakurio just wants a friend until she's bored and then kills you. Nah, nah, that's not how Kakuya works. Well, thank God we're actually fun for Kakuya. You reveal secrets. Uh oh. Uh oh. No. No. Because Ami mentioned something about NG, and now I know about NG, and Kakuya doesn't like I know about NG. And guess what? Kaku is bored now. <laughs> nah, she's not bored, but uh, let me tell you one thing. She's getting bored. So we might have less time than we, th than we may have first thought, so... Shit. Yeah, that's a good way to put it. Shit. Kakuryo. Kakariyo? Kakariko Village. Are we gonna have to kill God by the end of this? No, no, no. <laughs> oh, the realm of the dead. This isn't Shin Megami NG. I'm glad Shin Megami Tensai is only Persona and literally nothing else. <laughs> I love the internet sometimes. Well, what can we do for now? Guess we can open up that chest and see what's inside. And inside was Davy Jones's heart. All in an envelope. Ah. What the... What's with this doll, though? Mary! Oh. That's weird. Ugh. It looks like cocky, almost. Oh my god! Hmm. Why does Miroku have a Kakuya doll? Wait a minute. If you take all the letters in Miroku and rearrange them around there, you get... Go Kakuya! <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's brilliant! What a breakthrough! Wow! <laughs> you solved the whole thing before! <laughs> <laughs> yes! What about the envelope? I got a feeling this is gonna be some good stuff. Scratch paper with some descriptions and things. Oh like no! Photos of girls. Oh no! No, please. Oh uh, boy. Uh, Stop! Uh, no! Uh, no! Uh, don't uh, even! Boy. No! So, we still don't know why he did it, though. Don't do it. Oh, he stalked them. No. She was turned into that. <sighs> well, yeah, because we saw her turned into like a bird. Don't look at my body. It's all fucked up and gross because a sick old weirdo did it to me. Uh, 
uh, well, it's a long story. But hey, I'm not cursed anymore. I'll tell you what happened at the bar. You're gonna need double shots. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, make mine a triple. Jesus, that was unnerving. I mean, I absolutely love the designs of these monsters. But sometimes they're a bit much. Well, well, uh, I'd s Oh. Oh, shit. Natsumi's mad. Hi, what did I do? Hey. What's up? Oh, God. Uh oh. Is always tattling on us. Ugh. Yeah. Uh -huh. God damn it, Oe. Look, there's a reason for it. All right. I'm hunting ghosts. Th this w this was just a a, a crazy chick who got turned into a crane, and she used her wire limbs to cut me up. It's nothing too bad. What, what, what was that about a Kimono? said it yourself. Well, I mean, it sounds absurd. Yeah, it sounds absurd. Because that's what happened. I mean, of yeah, course. take a seat. Yes. I mean, I, I'll tell her. Sure. Yeah, no problem. Might as well at this point. Okay, Good. I'm, gl so. I'm glad they just skipped this part. <clears throat> well, yeah, I mean. So, you'll be glad to know that the, the, the rest of the cases won't be as fucked up as this. That doesn't mean they're gonna be any less fucked up. But we still don't know why, and that's what I'm waiting for. Well, you gotta wait a little bit on the why. It's too many questions right now. But everything's gonna start to come together eventually. Got something nuts in me? Just imagine if the drive to make horror novels overtook her love for her daughter, so she takes out a notepad and a pen and goes, Kakurio, this will be great for my next novel. Anyway, she, continue. She's capitalizing on this tragedy to the nth <laughs> <Yeah>. degree. <laughs> uh, and then Ami becomes a vengeful spirit when we can't save her. Very tragic. Oh, yeah, that thing. That is gruesome. I like how you can't tell what it is, but you can tell what it is. Yeah, you can definitely tell the arms, but that face is disfigured beyond belief. Yeah, that was my question. So, yeah, is he psychotic? No, he's not. So if you think that he's chopping off kids' arms and legs to satisfy some sick desire, no, that's not it. So there goes my theory.
Yes, please, end double. Reach into my brain, take my thoughts, and expound them to everybody else. Why is something off here? Oh, I know. This plant is out, is unaligned. Need to just... Oh, right. Yeah. yeah. Can you move it just a couple centimeters to the left? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Just, just. Right. Oh. And there, perfect. Yes, there we go. Perfect. No, 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 it's okay, I'm already doing it. Yeah, I Save was already- Save fucking lootly I was already there, so you're fine. What kind of asshole would be all the way negative on that uh, I was just thinking that. Who? Which one of you out there? Who? What the fuck, I want to save Ami, that's stupid, God. <laughs> God. Oh, well, wait, you could have- Oh, you could have saved it there. Yeah. Well, then again, you're locked into the good or bad part of this chapter. We're still, uh... We're not locked into the good ending yet. We're, it could still go good or normal, depending on how the next case goes. So, do one of these two perish? Well, we'll get to that. <laughs> okay. And rank, I'm the one who does everything. I don't no, I don't want to go back. Why do I gotta go back? Why don't you just go? Why do I gotta come with you? God, this guy does every form of gambling. <sighs> yeah, we're messing with that corpse. Well, a different corpse. Are we going to try to find a blood splatter that, you know, will work? All right, what are we doing here? What's that? Oh. Uh. Uh. Okay. Uh, okay. Qu qu uh, quick prayer. Uh. May hey, yeah, you. I, I'll do it. Yeah. Uh. Rest in peace as a person and not a bird. Uh, yeah. Okay. You know, nobody else has thought about this. Kind of, yeah. So it might have been one of the monsters from Deathmark who got his son. Oh! oh. That's cool! I, I mean, it's a good callback. I'm sorry that his son died. <laughs> Which one do you think it was? Hanayomi? Miss Zoo? I'm gonna say Miss Zoo. Will we ever find out? No. Okay, I didn't think so. Also, were those the only two you could remember? I'm pretty sure Hanahiko wasn't it. I'm pretty sure Little Red Riding Hood wasn't it. I'm pretty sure it wasn't, uh... The Big B guy. I forgot his... <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> The big B. 
Oh god, that was a spirit. Man, I, I gotta <laughs> redo Deathmark, because I forgot all the amazing spirits in there. At least he pays my fare. So right then and there, that was where the game checked if Bond was going to live or die. Oh, okay, so she would have... She would have totally killed him. Okay. Even though he was doing the prayer, or does he not even get that far? Just wrapped him up in wires and just squeezes the life Kill. out of him. Oh, Interesting. So. We gotta find out more about Yakumo Moroku. Mur Ami's in the Realm mm -hmm. of the Dead. Now we know where she is. So yeah. Feels good uh, to put an ending on that chapter, dear god. I... what? No. No, I don't have all the answers. Why? <sighs> well, I guess that does it for this episode of NG. No, there's gotta be more. Still so many questions. The questions we can't answer right now. I would love to find out, N-Double. So there's a yet another day that we can do, actually. Holy shit. Okay. I was wondering. I didn't want to check the time <laughs> just to see if you were pulling my leg or not. Pulling your leg and spray painting it. Please, no. I don't want to be a chicken. Oh, there we go. Oh, it better not scream at me again. Wait, it's Amanome. So here's where we would get our first uh, divergence if you were to pick Hazuki or Amanome. It's here. Ah. Hazuki would obviously call her. Mm hmm. See, yeah, Ami's in the Realm of the Dead. No big deal. NBD. NBD. Oh, man, I knew I should have saved Hazuki. Yeah, Amanome, you're kind of useless in this regard. Why didn't we pick the occult girl? Gee, I wonder why we didn't pick the occult girl. Because we're playing on hard mode. Does she seriously make the game harder? I, I, I bet she'll say it. I've never heard of that before. I have no idea. Well, so slight divergence. As I figured. I guess that's the only choice. <laughs> well, good to hear from Amanome, I guess. Yeah. Alright. Time to go to bed. I love how we can see the outline of the wallpaper we tore off yesterday. <laughs> Wow, straight to bed, really? But... Oh, That's come probably on. OA or something. Oh, come on. Nobody there. Girl Scouts. Go! <laughs> scared the fuck out of me but I couldn't form words and then the fact that you just 
turned around and was like, yep, nope. <laughs> oh, God. Why did we get that? It's still going. We have one more day to do. It's Monday. Because Kaki has to give us the next goal. Oh. I thought we would get this in the next chapter, but I guess we're just continuing on. Kakuya, I know you're here. This is where you hang out. <laughs> there you are. Hey, how's it going? Good evening. No, you're not. You don't look you're happy. You're pissed. Yeah. yeah, you're pissed. I am happy. So, so happy. Damn it! <laughs> ah, shit. See, I told you, it was that fast. And you're like, yeah, no, she's not. She's really mm. bad at Monopoly, too. She never places a hotel, and she always goes for Boardwalk and Park Place. It's so weird. She's already got the next game in mind. It's the Killer Peach game. <clears throat> if you don't play, it'll disappear, too, and I mean, will never come. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I'm just imagining James and the giant peach, except the giant peach has teeth. Fuck. Well, I looked online and I found some great deals on peaches. I found some really good tasting peaches, but Ooh. nothing about killer peach. So we're just going to completely ignore that eyeball in our peephole, right? It's probably just some ghost. Probably just some ghost, or they really wanted to recreate Condemned 2's box art. Or it could be the next spirit. Already? Mm. Hey, wait, I didn't get closure. Mm. I never understood why that guy killed those girls. Mm. I guess you got to keep watching. God oh. damn it. <laughs> yep. Ah! What do you think they're gonna give you such a big secret all willy nilly? No fucking way. Look, if I like and subscribe, can you just tell me? Like and subscribe and, like, super chat me 20 bucks. <laughs> we'll see you next time on Spirit Hunter NG.